is stopping us. Thank you. I call Jim Allister. <coughs> Mr. Acting Speaker, I, I start by joining in the uh, repeat of the condolences to Ali Gason, and it's good to see him here today which, uh, in the difficult circumstances that he and his family have found themselves. Mr. Acting Speaker, Daki's law indisputably needs to be completed, and until it is completed, I would certainly be urging as many citizens as possible to opt in to the donation service. But Daki's law can only now be completed in the only operative legislature which is capable of doing it, and that's at Westminster. And I would urge the Secretary of State to stop politicking and get on with that mission. And if Sinn Féin are sincere and so aghast about boycotts, then let them be there to help vote it through. We'll see then the depth of their sincerity and concern about Daki's law. As for this place, Mr Acting Speaker, I fear that the Supreme Court has helped seal its fate. When the highest court in the land decrees that a key component of the Acts of Union is in suspension because the protocol is superior and supreme to it, then there is a constitutional crisis and dismantling of the Union that no unionist can ignore. Now, what is the union? The union is a political union, it's an economic union. The political union from the Acts of Union lies in the creation of a single sovereign parliament, and the economic union lies in the creation of a single economic unit within which there is to be free and unfettered trade between and within all parts of the United Kingdom. But we now know courtesy of the Supreme Court, that that key component, Article 6 of the Acts of Union, has been subjugated. It is in suspension. And that is a fundamental assault upon the Union that many of us on this side of the House believe in. And that is compounded by a ruling given in our own courts. The case of Rooney against Puts, just a few weeks ago, ruled that any executive, the ministers within it, by law, have to implement the protocol and the REC border. And that is why no unionist can put their hand to the implementation of the self-destruction of the union in which they believe. And that is why this place is in the condition it's in. As for the EU talks, they're not going to resolve this issue because the sovereignty issue is not even on the table. And unless and until the fact that the sovereignty issue is addressed, which comes to this, that under the protocol, Northern Ireland is within and subject to the EU's customs code, which means GB is decreed a foreign country whose goods must be checked. And we are subject colony-like to laws we don't make and can't change. Unless and until those sovereignty issues are addressed, then this place is doomed. And so it should be. Thank you. I call Jerry Carl. Thank you, Mr. Acting Speaker. I want to associate comments uh, in uh, wishing Alex Easton uh, well and pass on our sympathies and also the comments about people who um, died in Turkey and Syria.